I do think this is a very, very unusual trilogy. The first movie, Unbreakable, was done in 2000 and was a completely distinct stylistic approach. And then we did Split. It had its own style that wasn't quite related to Unbreakable, but I thought that could be our great asset, that this trilogy is three separate feelings that are talking about the same subject. So I wanted Glass to be able to stand on its own and not be derivative of either movie. I think it's a valid culmination of a story. Elijah is still very calculating. He's still very watchful. He's still strong in his conviction. I remember watching Unbreakable in a movie theater in New York City somewhere, and now here I am, and there's Sam Jackson, and there's Bruce Willis in a really great, scary, psychological thriller of a movie. And so to be part of all of that is really a dream come true. Split didn't even feel like a superhero movie at all. It was a scary movie that only really revealed itself at the end when David Dunn actually shows up. That took it way beyond just linking it to Unbreakable.